y'all. So let's just get straight into the video. So first and foremost, I just want to say thank you so much to this hair company for sending me over this beautiful unit. The hair company name is Hair Spells. Let me make sure I'm saying it right before I butcher their name, okay? So they did send your girl over some hair. So let's see what the hair is giving. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell y'all, these bags that the wigs be coming in, don't throw these away, keep them, okay? <laughs> because when you get done with your wigs, you could just throw your wig back in a bag and then, you know, tie it up and store it properly because if you just throw your wig to the side it's gonna be tangled up okay so keep y'all little duster bags so it did come with these lashes okay these are super cute usually i do not like lashes that hair companies send but these are actually kind of cute i think i'm gonna wear these but y'all let's get into the fun part okay let's get into the wig baby let's get into the wig oh yeah y'all by the way i did do my eyebrows and my lashes just a little something something you feel me so we could look like somebody it did come with their contact information their telling their phone number, their email, and their website if any of you guys are interested in checking them out. Also on top of that, I'm going to make sure I drop all the information down on this wig down below. So y'all, this is the wig. In first impressions, the hair is so freaking soft, y'all. This hair right here, this is some good hair. I don't know if y'all can tell on the camera, but this is some good freaking hair. It is so freaking soft. So I did send over a 22 inch closure wig, y'all. Let me show y'all the closure. Cause the closure looks so freaking good. Y'all cannot tell me that's not gonna eat down. Baby, that's gonna eat down. I don't know about y'all, but I love me a good closure. Closures give me one, two, three and out the door, okay? Another thing that I really like about this closure is that the knots are not big at all. So they will be easy to bleach if you wanted to bleach them. Bleaching your knots is really up to you. Like you could do it if you want to, but if you don't want to, you necessarily don't have to. Cause at the end of the day, if you know how to lay a wig down, the ground baby, it's gonna give. I normally do bleach my knots, but I'm not gonna do it in this video, but I bet you it still eats down. What you wanna do is you wanna get your wig head and then you wanna prep your wig. Always make sure that you guys are prepping your wigs before y'all just slap them on your head. So I'm gonna take this wig cap, put it onto my wig head. This gonna be the wig right here. This gonna be the one in the mouth So, okay. <laughs> All right, let's be for real. Y'all tell me if y'all can see the closure. This is, this is on the wig head now. So just imagine what it's gonna give when it's on the actual head. Can y'all see the closure? Yeah, I ain't think so. Y'all wanna know it's so crazy. I was thinking about getting me a sew-in, a closure sew-in, and honestly, I, I don't even need to get me a closure sew-in no more, baby, cause this is a closure wig. It's gonna order the same thing. And I'm telling y'all, these, these wig companies, they be knowing. It's like they be reading your mother mind at this point. Cause how y'all knew that this literally was gonna be my next hairstyle, just in a different form, but it was literally gonna look the same. Make sure y'all get y'all a wax stick to push back your baby hairs before you flat iron them. After that, I'll go in with a little bit of got to be spray to where I can keep the baby hairs pushed back to where when we lay our wig down, the baby hairs is not going to go anywhere, okay? These two right here is what you're going to need to prep your wig. Make sure y'all prep your wigs because if you do not prep your wig, I'm trying to tell you, it's going to come out ugly. It's going to come out ugly every single time and then on top of that, it's not going to eat down. so the wig is nice and prepped do y'all see that do y'all see how flat that looks i did not get a chance to um flat iron the hair in the back just yet but my main focus was making sure all the hair in the front was pulled straight back where when we lay that lace down baby it's gonna give scalp okay so make sure you guys are not skipping that step oh yeah by the way like i said make sure y'all um spray some got to be spray on there i actually forgot to do that putting the got to be spray on my lace is actually something that i just started doing i haven't been doing that i ain't gonna pretend like i have but one thing that i have noticed is that it makes a huge difference like before when i was only using my wax stick i felt like it was you know what i'm saying it was getting the baby hairs but this right here is what was sealing the deal so make sure y'all go ahead and spray a little got to be baby hairs are not gonna go anywhere i like to make it sound like it's fine like some chicken get it so for the glue for today i'm gonna use boho active glue by the hair diagram yeah don't talk about my hair okay one two three <laughs> Uh, this is crazy no cap this is crazy right here these braids are literally like three weeks old now they look atrocious y'all look at this my hair is so freaking long like i got this little piece sticking out in the back y'all 
crazy right i'm gonna get my hair washed next week and rebraid it up so yeah we just gonna have to make it do what it do i'm about to go in with this edge control this edge control right here smells so freaking good it smells like lemons and i don't know why i'm addicted to that smell but i'm not gonna say addicted to it but i don't know why i like the smell of lemons actually i think the reason why i like the smell of lemons is because it just has this clean smell to it you know like lemons just give fresh clean kitchen i'm gonna make sure i push these baby hairs back so we can have a nice clean hairline if you guys have any good suggestions for a bad dandruff can y'all please drop it in the comment section below i have very bad dandruff um i could literally wash my hair today and my hair be my head not hair be full of dandruff by tomorrow so if y'all have any good suggestions on shampoos or medications or just anything in general that y'all use for y'all dandruff please drop it in the comment section below because your girl is on a hunt for a good dandruff shampoo like something that's really just not only clean the dandruff up because cleaning the dandruff is not a problem the problem is keeping the dandruff away it's so crazy because when i go get my hair done and i sit in the chair before they even touch my hair i just let them know up front i'm like look okay baby i don't need you to talk about me once i leave i'm gonna go ahead and let you know now i have really bad dandruff okay i'm not nasty i'm not dirty i wash my hair my dandruff is just out of control literally every time i sit in somebody's chair they be like like, girl that's good dandruff means your hair gonna grow fast i'm like what baby i don't care about my hair growing fast i don't want no dandruff like dandruff is very aggravating i trip and talk about some dandruff is good dandruff is not good there's nothing nothing good about having dandruff okay so now that we have the hairline pushed back well not the hairline the baby hair is pushed back i'm gonna go in with my got to be glue and i'm going to put a little glue right here and i'm gonna put about two three layers not maybe not even three two layers of glue let it dry clear and then we're gonna lay that lace down y'all see that <laughs> this is what i mean when i say prep the wig when i say prep the wig this is literally what i mean when you pull the wig off the wig head baby the whole thing is just sleek back okay so i'm gonna go ahead and throw this wig on right quick let me adjust this band because it does not look adjust it whatsoever i just know this is about to eat down like i just know for a fact like oh this wig cap is a large too period that means this wig right here is gonna eat mm -hmm. yes ma'am yes ma'am this is so crazy i literally was just about to buy me some hair and this wig company reached out i low-key want to cut this into a bob like yeah so make sure that glue dries clear before y'all put your lace down it's looking very much clear to me so I'm gonna go ahead and lay that lace down and I'm gonna put my band on and then we're gonna let it sit for an hour. All right, y'all, so this is the final look. I think it looks so freaking cute, y'all. The wig, baby, let's just talk about it right quick, okay? Hold on, let me just bring it out a little closer so y'all can see, because I don't think y'all see for real, okay? I don't think y'all looking at what I'm looking at. But y'all, let's just get straight into it. So first impressions, the hair is super freaking soft. Like when I tell y'all, probably one of the softest this hair I felt in a long time literally so freaking soft and another thing that i like about the wig is that you know how sometimes the density can be too freaking thick to where it's just like overwhelming like that's one thing that i cannot stand about hair companies i cannot stand when they try to put too much hair into the wig to where it's overwhelming it's too much to flat iron too much to curl like baby just give me just enough so i can go by my way this wig right here literally perfect okay and then on top of that like the the hair is giving brazilian it's giving persian it's giving peruvian i bet y'all i had to just swap out my battery because my other battery died it's so ghetto but anyways like i was saying y'all i don't know what kind of hair this is but this hair is so freaking good and not even to mention this is a closure <laughs> this literally took no time to install what like 10 15 minutes if that and just let your band sit on for an hour like baby like the wig is eating down like i just want to say thank you so much hair spells for sending me over this beautiful unit it's like literally perfect and it's so crazy it's almost as if they were reading my thoughts like i literally was just thinking about getting a closure sewing because it's getting hot outside and i'm just getting tired of wigs and they sent your girl a closure wig do y'all see how shiny this is like what this is some good freaking hair right here like no cap if any of y'all are interested in purchasing this unit i will have all the information down in the description box below and this is going to conclude the video if you have not make sure you guys hit that subscribe button before you leave make sure you guys like and comment and i'll see you guys in my next video